I have been at Viria Trucking, it'll be seven years in August of this year, so flew by. My career transition, um, I went to school at University of Wisconsin Green Bay and while I was there, my parents' neighbor worked at Schneider National and said, hey, we have some internships. I had no idea what Schneider National was, what they did, other than that they had some more trucks that went all over. I didn't even understand the concept that they brought things to the store. Um, and I started out uh, doing pricing and rating as an intern and then after college graduated and did pricing and rating in the intermodal division for two years. Transitioned into a final financial analyst role there within their bulk and their dedicated divisions for two years. And then I actually um, moved over to the shipper side and worked at Georgia Pacific as a pricing um, manager for two years. And then I found myself here at Viria and I started out as um, a pricing manager and I was in that role for four and a half years. And now I am the director of revenue, I'm the director of pricing and revenue management and I have been in that role for almost two and a half years now. I'm a big numbers person. Um, I like to have data that's behind everything. I don't just make a decision based off of emotion or um, somebody's one opinion. I like to have the data that backs it. Not that I don't get emotional at times about things, but big on numbers, analytics, and I'm a huge Excel nerd and love looking at Excel spreadsheets. Um, not sure why, but it just, it's fun to me and it's not fun to most people. I think sometimes I come across more confident than I am. Um, I want to feel that I know what I'm doing and can do it well and many times I fake my way through that so I guess the biggest thing is I'm not always confident in what I'm doing or know what I'm doing and I think people think that I do at all times. What does it mean to me to be a leader at Viria? Um, I would say I really enjoy watching the team grow and develop. Um, it's fun and very cool to see somebody who didn't want to talk to a customer or didn't want to talk to a driver and with some of the personal development and the different um, things they've been exposed to now is confident to have a conversation with a customer whether it be good or bad or you know have to address something you know with a shipper or a receiver and it's just seeing that confidence that you know I've helped build with that team um, and help them develop into the people that they're becoming so that they can too someday become leaders and do that same thing to other um, people that are on our team.